Hello everyone. I hope you're all well. Right. This is going to be a quick video um, about an issue that's been brought to my attention. Um, it's rather unpleasant. Um, so that's the first thing we're going to talk about. And then I'm going to talk about some more positive things. So this video is really about something I want to make you guys aware of and also um, just to let you know about a couple of things, okay? So the first thing I'm going to talk about, as I say, it's rather unpleasant and it has been brought to my attention and it's, it has pissed me off a little bit. This kind of thing, I, I don't like this kind of thing. And I've had to take a little bit of action on this. If you see um, on my channel, on any of my videos, any posts, messages, or links to videos from a Dr. Itua, I T U A Itua. Totally disregard, this is my advice, totally disregard them and ignore them, okay? Because it appears this individual, this Dr. Itua, has decided. Um, to post multiple posts and messages on my videos, um, basically advertising his miracle cure, his miracle cure for tinnitus, um, which appears to be nothing more than some fluorescent glowing, what I can only describe as green slime. All right, what you're supposed to do with this stuff, I don't know, drink it, have a bath in it, who knows? All right. I looked at his channel and there's a couple of videos on there of this stuff being poured into bottles and then um, there's another video saying here it is here's the cure um, being packaged up and sent to all these lucky people that are going to be cured of their tinnitus with my green liquid slime all right um, there's no information whatsoever about what this stuff is, what it contains, you know, what you're supposed to do with it. But what there is, is details of how to contact him to buy the stuff. So in my opinion, just my opinion, all right, this is a scam, okay? So I've blocked him from posting um, messages and videos on my channel, I hope, okay? But if any do get through and you do see them, I want to make it clear, right, that I have no connection with this Dr. Ichua. I don't endorse or advocate his channel or his treatment. He has nothing to do with me, all right? And I want to dis disassociate myself with this, this person, all right? So that's that. Uh, moving on, more positive things. I wanted to say to those of you who've um, emailed me about uh, wanting to have a one-to-one -one with me, uh, do I offer it on WhatsApp? I do offer it on WhatsApp, one-to-ones, but I much, much prefer, um, you know, WhatsApp on the phone. I don't like using the mobile phone very much. But I do offer it on WhatsApp, but I much prefer Zoom. Zoom I find is much more reliable and it's just a more um, pleasant way I think of um, conversing with someone than on the phone so I much prefer Zoom on PC all right um, as I say so if you do have Zoom I would prefer that however if you don't have Zoom um, I will offer WhatsApp but um, I prefer Zoom okay and if you want a one-to-one -to -one to one to one with me it's um, Adrian D 2016 again at gmail.com email me and then I'll send you all the details of um, how we go about it the other thing is if you have contacted me because uh, I'm still getting emails from people saying I sent you an email aid you haven't replied are you not doing one to ones etc etc um, I will get in touch with you I know some of you um, are going through a bad time um, 
hello to Vernica and Shelby, by the way. Um, I'm looking forward to talking to both of you again, okay? Um, I have sent you some videos. I hope they're helpful to you. Um, take heart, you can um, get on your path to recovery. Things will get better, okay? So it's just a special mention for you two. Um, yeah, for those of you that have contacted me and I haven't got back to you, uh, in the UK, at the moment, all the schools are shut and I have my uh, little boy, Aaron, who's autistic, staying with me. And he's taken up some, um, you know, a lot of my attention. He needs a lot of my attention. So I'm trying to work appointments around all of this going on. So please bear with me, but I will get in touch with you, okay? Um, and finally, um, in my next video, I'm going to return to a subject um, that I haven't spoken about for a long time, and Deadpool, you wanted to know about this, and um, who else was it? Uh, Lydia, you want you emailed me about this, and Grom's World, you've just watched my original video, and you want an update on. Um, when I took my trip to Florida, um, for those of you that don't know and haven't seen the video, I took a trip to Florida a long time ago to, see, to meet with a doctor for a controversial treatment for tinnitus, um, which was injections into the back of the head and into the spine. Okay, and I met with this doctor and I had the treatment, and the treatment, um, it did have an effect and it did release tinnitus, tinnitus, albeit temporarily. And if you want to see that original video, where I talk about my experience in Florida with this doctor, the video is on my channel. Okay, but I'd like say a couple of you have got in touch with me and you'd like an update on what the doctor's doing now. What do I think about the treatment now after all this time? Do I still have the same opinion of it? Is it something I'd have again? Um, do you think it's worth for you to go and try it yourself? And this all centers around the area at the back of the head, and I'm going to talk about this connection um, with this area at the back of the head where the skull meets the spine, the connection with tinnitus, that I believe absolutely there is a connection, um, because I have, um, I have come across some more information that really bears out what I said all that time ago about this connection with this area at the back of the head and its influence on tinnitus. So I've got some new information on that which kind of bears out what I said. All right, so we'll get into that and I'm also gonna talk a little bit about diet and this new wonder food source that I found that is just wonderful for reducing inflammation and any digestive problems because everything's connected. You know, the stomach, um, the brain in the body. Your stomach's a good indication of stress and one can affect the other, etc., etc. All stuff we've talking about before, but I'll, I'll get into it. All right, so that's it. Um, as I say, Dr. Ichua, nothing to do with me. Um, it is up to you if you want to visit his channel and buy yourself a pot of uh, green slime. Um, if you fancy that, I don't think it's going to do you much good, but hey. All right, that's it. Thank you everyone, um, best wishes to you all and I will talk to you soon, bye bye.